Imagine a little kitten, found alone and terrified on a cold, rainy night, hiding under a car. This is not the beginning of a tale spun from whimsy. No, this is a narrative that is all too real. The story of a small feline named Whiskers. Whiskers was discovered in such a plight, her wide eyes glinting in the dim light, her body trembling from fear and the biting chill. She was a picture of sheer terror and vulnerability, a stark reminder of the harsh realities many animals face. Whiskers' tale is one of trauma, an experience that would go on to shape her behavior and quality of life. Trauma, much like it does in humans, can leave a lasting impact on cats, altering their trust in the world around them. This is the tale of Whiskers, a cat that endured trauma, a tale that mirrors the lives of countless cats worldwide. Trauma in cats, much like in humans, can stem from a multitude of sources. It could be the result of physical abuse, a terrible history of abandonment, or even sudden changes in their environment. Cats, being creatures of habit, are particularly sensitive to these abrupt alterations in their world. Now how can you tell if a cat is traumatized? Well, the signs can be subtle but they are there. You might notice changes in behavior, perhaps your normally playful feline friend has become withdrawn and unresponsive. Eating habits can also be affected, with some traumatized cats eating too little or too much. Social interactions may change too. A cat that once loved being petted may now shy away from human touch. Remember, understanding these signs is the first step in helping a traumatized cat. It's about being observant, patient, and empathetic. Recognizing the signs of trauma is the key to unlocking a new beginning for cats like Whiskers. Providing care for a traumatized cat may seem daunting, yet it's not an impossible task. The key lies in three essential elements, patience, consistency, and an abundance of love. When dealing with a traumatized cat, it's crucial to establish a safe and secure environment for them. This could be a cozy corner in your home, a room where they feel comfortable, or even a special box that they can retreat to when they're feeling scared. Using comforting sounds can also make a significant difference. Play soft, soothing music, or maintain a calm, low voice when interacting with them. Remember, sudden loud noises can be terrifying for a traumatized cat. Consulting with a professional, such as a vet or a pet behaviorist, can provide invaluable guidance. They can offer personalized strategies based on your cat's specific needs and behavior. With time, patience, and a whole lot of love, even the most traumatized cat can learn to trust again. Whiskers' journey was far from easy, but it was not without its victories. Once a bundle of nerves twitching at shadows, Whiskers began to transform. The tremors lessened, the hisses grew fewer. With each passing day, the once traumatized cat started to show signs of trust. The techniques we've discussed previously played a pivotal role in this transformation. Consistent routines, gentle interactions, and a safe environment worked wonders. Whiskers found solace in predictability, comfort in the familiar. From a cat that flinched at every touch, she became one that sought out affection. The sparkle returned to her eyes, the spring to her step. This wasn't an overnight change, it was a journey. A journey of small victories, of trust rebuilt one day at a time. Whiskers' transformation serves as an inspiring testament to the resilience of cats and the power of compassionate care. Whiskers' story is a testament to the power of love and patience. It's a reminder that with understanding and care, we can help bring light back into the lives of our feline friends.